Penn has an incredibly vibrant campus. There is creativity in every single one of our 12 schools, and art is a part of each of those schools and each location on campus. So everywhere you go, you see art. You see art in front of the library with the Klaus Oldenburg button. You see the portrait of Benjamin Franklin or Ben on the bench as you're passing up Locust Walk. There's some amazing art on Penn's campus and some of it you don't even know about until you walk down Locust Walk and find yourself in front of this extraordinary red sculpture up the street and it's a huge piece and somehow you walk under it without even realizing it's art and then you look at it and you realize Locust Walk is in fact a gallery. No one could ever say, oh, I've seen all the art at Penn, because uh, shows are coming and going all the time. We have art exhibits happening uh, in an amazing array of places. Spaces like the Perry World House are perfect for uh, lovely art, and it can accommodate art of many different genres, whether it's painting or photographs or uh, three-dimensional sculpture. Richard and Lisa Perry not only have given this fabulous global center called the Perry World House, but when we were proposing artwork for the site, they decided that instead of taking things from the university art collection, they would donate things most generously. And they, they've actually donated 20 works of art, which is just extraordinary. And they're all mainly cutting edge international artists from contemporary Iranian artist Shirin Nishat to, for instance, a beautiful Brian Hunt sculpture outside, which represents a figure, Masnad. We tried to pick art from a lot of different countries. So, uh, for instance, in Bill's office, you have American art by Tom Otterness with the reference to Ben Franklin. You have Korean art with reference to, to gender, which is really interesting. On the stairway over here, you have a, an English artist. And then downstairs, when you walk in, on your right, you have a Korean photographer who exposed a photograph of the DMZ. Art enriches uh, the human spirit. And I believe every young person needs an opportunity to explore the many, many genres of art that can enlarge and enrich their understanding of, of our common humanity, whether it's dance or theater or architecture. The arts are incredibly important and we're happy and proud that Penn is a place where students can enhance their ability to write creatively, but also to, to dance and to sing and to uh, explore.